Hi, I'm Maggie the music teacher and during our coronavirus shutdown I've been teaching online. I do not love it. So I'm making some videos that might be a little helpful to my students and give us a little more interaction and I've decided to make them public in case someone else finds them useful. I'm a flutist but I was trained as a generalist which means I'm kind of a jack of all trades, master of none except flute. So if you're looking for virtuosic top shelf playing, this is not it. Uh, I don't have time to edit videos and make fancy videos, so most of these will be in one take and that will include mistakes. If you think you can learn from that, fantastic. If it's not what you're looking for, move on now. You can see what a generalist does and I hope you find something useful. This intro will be on the beginning of each video, so I'm going to put the information of what I'm doing down below. And if you want to skip this on future videos forward ahead about a minute, that should put you about in the right place. On to the next video. I will be playing the melody of Bach's Menuet in G as it is written in the Suzuki Method Book for Flute number 15. I will be changing the eighth note grace note in measure eight to a quarter note. I will also be playing the bass line to this as it is written in a piano score off of imslp.org. When I play the bass line, I will be jumping octaves now and then, and our parts will cross, which is not ideal, but it serves this purpose. The purpose is for the student to play the melody line either both times, so we'll play once in unison, and once when I drop to the bass line, they'll continue playing the melody, and we'll have a little duet. Or if they want to practice their bass clef reading, they can play the bass line when I play the melody first, and then switch, and we'll have a duet the whole time. I think that is it for now. I'm going to set the metronome on at 120 and count off. One, two, three. Bye.